A New Year's mystery in Connecticut now. Stanford police are investigating what they consider the suspicious disappearance of a 63-year-old man. CBS 2's Tony Aiello was at the scene of a search this afternoon. Police from Stanford and Westport teaming up to search a southbound stretch of I-95, looking for evidence in the disappearance of 63-year-old Errol White. No dementia, no um, medical issues that we would know that would cause him to, to walk away. Captain Diedrich Hohn says the stretch between exits 18 and 17 is where a family member located the missing man's SUV on Friday parked on the shoulder. Errol White, a native of Jamaica, was last seen on Thursday, December 29th, leaving his son's home in Bridgeport. Cops searched the vehicle and found an empty money bag lying on top of White's wallet. A bank money bag, like uh, for night deposit drops, that's in there. Um, the two cell phones were in there, and then on top of it, we added his keys, but the key to the car was not in there. So that's, you know, the car does look like it was just stopped there, perfectly stopped, and then from there on in, we don't know what happened to him. Monday afternoon, an investigator stopped by the Stanford home where White rented a first floor apartment. The landlord tells me Errol White has lived quietly here for about 20 years, working jobs in construction and landscaping. We look like family because we've been around me for, for so long and to just know he's just missing without a trace. It's like I'm, I, I'm, I'm very destroyed. It's kind of baffling right now, but it's his worst. Police will continue to search along 95 for evidence and ask drivers who saw anything suspicious on Thursday the 29th to contact them. In Westport, Connecticut, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News.